Parashat Tzav, Aliyah Shlishit. This Aliyah now is discussing Zeva Hashelamim. Zeva Hashelamim is a Korban that's given to Hashem. However, it is allowed for the Kohen and his Banav and his children to eat from this, from this Korban. Now this Korban has two different types of Zeva Hashelamim. There is one type of Korban, which is called the Korban Toda, to give thanks as an offering, to give thanks to Hashem. And the other korban is called neder or nedava. Let's first discuss what a toda is. Korban toda is a korban that a person gives thanks and gratitude to Hashem for four different scenarios. One is if a person he was healed from sickness, chole. The second one was yam, if he crossed the sea, crossed the body of water. Third one is yotzei bet kele, he gets out of jail. And the fourth one is mem, midbar. Stands for Hashem Tevot, Chaim. Those are the four scenarios that a person has to give thanks to Hashem. And this is where the Inyan, is the Minhag that we have, what the Halakha says, that a person has to say, Hagomel. Where does it come from? It comes from the concept of Korban Toda. The other part of this Shalamim is the Korban called Neder or Nedava. A person gives a Korban for his promise or vow that he makes to give something to the Mikdash. Those are two different types of Zevach HaShlamim. And now these Korbanot are given and there are certain rules attained to each one. For instance, we learn also the Dinim of Halev. person can eat the certain fats of the animal. And if a person eats the Korban and he is not Tahor, Nechreta HaNefesh, person becomes Karet. If he eats the Halev, he becomes Taret. So there's deens, there's halachot, dinim, about what to eat, how to eat, when to eat. But this is called zevach hashelamim. 